Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're existing in the land of Dying Light. But with Dying Light 2 coming out, I thought why not get this on my channel so that we have a little bit of for those of you who don't have, who haven't seen it, a little bit of story on behind it. Okay. I have a lot of hours in this game. What is that? 777 hours? Holy fuck. Okay, but what we're going to do is we're going to do a new game. Okay, we're going to go single player because I don't really want to deal with that right now. We're going to go this. And we're going to go nightmare mode. <sighs> it's been a, a, a while since I've played this. Data on the subject, Kadir Suleiman. A I don't local this political part. figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. In 10 seconds. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion's structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. Maybe I do remember this part vaguely. I told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Fall back! Fall back! Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to go through the tutorial, but I think I remember most of the controls. <laughs> uh. You're scared. I'm not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Oh. 
I supposed to like talk to these kids? I really don't remember. Are you here? Children? Children? Hold on, my flashlight. Okay, that's crouch. Okay. Oh my god. Where the hell did the kids go? They came this way. What the fuck? Are they over here? Oh, they are. You sleep for three days like a dead man, then scare children? Off to a great start, 31. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. A bus will brief you. What do you mean, Excuse 31? Me. Ask the boss. Thirty-one. That's your number. Excuse me? Your number. You're the 31st infected. I'm the 18th. Everything is counted here. One fewer doses of antizin. One more new infected. One more runner gone. That's so depressing. Jesus Christ. Okay, um, yes. Oh yeah, I am gonna have to go through the frickin' tutorial. Hey, I'm looking for the... Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your antizen was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know my runners put their lives in danger for guys like you. So now you take the antizen meant for someone else and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore. So go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey. Be fair, I'm not, I'm not lazy, I'm just, hey, boss. Save it. That lost guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave -in. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. Wow, what an asshole. Where do you think you're going? The thirteenth floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. Thirteen? Shit. That's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull our weight around here, huh? Alrighty. Fuck it. Ugh. Hey, Kavi, how's it going? Jesus. How many people died here? I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antizen ASAP. Help! Help! Somebody! What the hell? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Worst <laughs> weapon in the game. Getting away from him. Oh, God. You had to kill him, didn't you? God damn it. Jesus Christ, this fucking game. This game's atmosphere is fucking incredible. Oh. Hey, hold still. Lena will be here any minute. Goss. You've got to find some goss. Oh, and alcohol. 
combine them. That will stop the bleeding. Please hurry. I try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back. Um, that's duct tape. Whatever, we'll take it. Metal. Oh, nice. It's always nice to see. Alcohol, nice. Oh, there we go. Okay, I think that's everything I'm gonna find. Let's give this a shot. Blueprints. Oh yeah, all of <laughs> all of my uh, DLC stuff. That's pretty funny. Okay. Take that. See what's in here. Duct tape. Nice. Back to him. Give him his nice med kit. Okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Goes in alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. Okay. Sounds good. What do you want, chunk? You chunky boy, huh? Yeah, that's right. Look at you and your pipe. My pipe's better. Sorry, Chief. You. Wow, that's a... You smoking? Unbelievable. It's bad for you, you know that? God damn. What's up, bitch? Alright, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? Explosives? Oh, I never please. said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. Yeah, Rahim. No, no, no explosives. You fucking drugger. So, so blow shit up, Rahim. Enough. Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. Wow. <laughs> okay, which one do I want to wear? I think I'm, I think I'm gonna wear okay, this Rahim, one. Okay, Rahim, I'm ready. What do I find Brecken? Suit. Not so fast, 31. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. Where do you want me to go? <laughs> oh, I can't slam it open. That's fucking lame. Yo, it's me, Subtilian X. I don't see you. Where are you? Those. What are you waiting for? Get over here. Okay. Get up there, boy. All right. You want to feel right at home? A crane? On a crane? Okay. Um. Hey, yo. Who is this? Is that... It's kind of hot. What's up, Raheem? Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, all right? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Are you nuts? I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. Raheem! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ha! I was just fucking with you! Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down here! Christ on a crutch. 
Yeet. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> Outside, if you stop, you're probably dead. Not bad. For a noob. Not even a noob. Jerk. Alright. Get up on that scaffold. And don't fall, because there sure as hell eats no net. Thanks. Cunt. Okay, that's enough. You've got some serious natural talent, man. Either that, or you've done this before. You done this before? Hardly. The closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. Huh. Well then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. Yay. There. What's what's happening to me? Shit. Shit. Oh, shit. Talk to me. What's going on? Something went wrong. Rahim, what just happened to me? Oh shit. I bet you're having your first seizure. Just get back over here. Well, I'm glad I did that. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Caesars reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of Antizen. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. Good. I'm glad. Okay, new guy. Be careful out there. We've lost too many already. Alright, bruh. I know this fucking map like the back of my goddamn hand. Okay, noob. You've got Dr. Zera set up in a semi-trailer on a fenced and plain court. When you leave the tower, hang a left and head due south. You can't miss it. It's Crane, kid. Alright, alright. Crane. Just keep moving. Yeah, fuck There's you. No time to take in the site. Oh. Okay, we gotta get fucking the best shit ASAP. If we're ever. Doctor? Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Damn it. Uh, so I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called antism. Suppresses the symptoms. Here, sit. Antism postpones the inevitable. Best the GRE could do. Inevitable, so th there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now, but you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and infected tissue. A cure is possible, definitely possible. Oh shit, you really think you can figure it out? With Dr. Camden's help, yes, I think so. Uh, now, where did I put that injector? Who's Dr. Camden? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero. Where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio, though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit, I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results but they didn't uh, it bore no fruit i'm ashamed that i wasted so much time on it no reason to hold any antizen in reserve now in any case all right i'm quite busy so on your way now what was i doing okay Everyone just wants to talk to me. Hey, Spike. Hey, Spike. Hey, just what I need. More unskilled labor. All right, shut up and pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One is food, first aid supplies, survival gear and such. The other kind is filled with antizen. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. 
Look, the trouble is, the airdrops with Antizen keep getting raided by Ryze's thugs, and without Antizen, we're basically screwed. Ryze and his boys only operate during the day, because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two Antizen drops are coming down right at sunset tonight, and Brecken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now, which I have. Now, Brecken and his team will be okay tonight so long as you get out there now and arm those traps. That's your part. All right. What are these traps and how do I arm them? You'll see. I'll be talking you through it. Just remember, without these traps, Brecken won't survive the night. And if he doesn't come back with Antizen, we are lost. Before you head out there, I okay. have some firecrackers. Made them myself. They Thank you. Find distraction if you get in trouble. Get out of the way, boy. Get out of the way. You fucking bastard. Yeah. So you stand there just so that you can bug me? Fuck you. Bitch ass. Spike, you got anything for me? No? Okay, whatever. Sounds good. Alright, let's go beat the shit out of some. Oh, okay. Don't. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, sir. Oh, why there's so goddamn many? Oh, hey. Yes. Fucking split them open like a watermelon. All right. Fuck. Um. Yes. Prepare the trap. We will. We'll also beat the tar out of zombies. Hey, you. How's it going? Just remember that I could kick the shit out of people. So. Let's do that, shall we? Kicking only run. Let's go. Okay, we should really start looting the crap out of things because some of the weapons that I can craft in the DLCs are really going to help me in this situation. So we need to get a lot of chemicals and boom! <laughs> Game. Okay, hold Y. Duh. Yeah! Fuck yes. $58? Damn, we're getting rich. I don't even think I have $58 to my name right now, in real life. Very sad, isn't it? Okay, let's actually get some shit done, shall we? Just, I can just do this. See? Look at that. Look at how effective this is. This is so effective. Nice. <laughs> fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Whew. I think it'd be really cool if I show you guys like nightmare mode where I just start in nightmare mode with like everything maxed out and like a full inventory of like god tier shit. Anything cool I could kill you guys on? No? Okay. Let's fucking jump out of here. Fucking slam this bitch with a fucking frying pan. Yeah. See? Night remote ain't got shit on the frying pan. Yes, sir. going this way. Fuck off! Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. Thank okay, Jade, you. I'm here, along with some infected. Watch yourself, Crane. Excuse me, just give me a moment. Just, you know, scavenging. Doing scav... I want this! You know what? Get me up here. Water pipe. There we go. Fuck. What else can I steal? Nail plank? Nice. Oh, another fl floor? No! Fuck out of here. Can't you see I'm busy? Yeah! Put, your, put, put some clothes on. Oh man, I think it's too late for this guy. Shit. Alright. Okay, it's done. Fuck. 
Oh, I got an adjustable wrench and it's blue. Woo! No hurry. You still need to turn on the lights. That's the only way to make this place safe at night. Okay. I just knew how to do that. Ah, shit. How's it coming? Got the lights on? Uh, oh, lights. Almost. Just give me a second. I'll take all y'all on. Nope. 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 Yeah, you scared? You afraid? Y'all are afraid, aren't you? Frying pan. Frying pan. Frying pan backhand. They just don't learn. Stay down. Okay, you know what? I'll make you stay down. There we go. Look at that, I just took on all these zombies with nothing but a pet frying pan and my feet. Crane here. Report. Okay, I met this doctor, scientist type. They've got him set up in a sort of research trailer and he's working on a cure for the virus. His name is Zara. Hello? Do you copy? Affirmative. Secondary objective added. Maintain your cover and secure all of his research. Acknowledge. Your stolen file still takes top priority though, right? Affirmative. We find it unlikely that a single researcher working out of a trailer could produce any significant results. But if he does, we want to see it. Understood. Okay, it's done. Good. We'll need to prepare more Yeet! Yeet! Wait, which way should I throw it? Yeet! Ah, oh, that was bad. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, don't even think about it. Oh, yeah, just fucking do it, bud. Yeah, just go, 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 go. Oh! I mean, I already took on like 600 of them, so it doesn't even matter, but I sort of want to get hit. Doesn't matter, fucking med kids. It's all your fault, you bastard. Oh. Maybe I want to. I like it. Everywhere. If I need to use a trap, how do I activate it? Shit. Okay. We're fine. See, look at this. I'm basically a ninja. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, nope. No, no, no. We don't do that here. That's fucking harassment. Ooh. You just got bread and buttered, bitch. Dead? Good. Ah, shit. I was going to search you. Come here. Cigarettes, nice. I'm gonna become a hardcore nicotine addict after this. Perfect. Ooh, an adjustable wrench. <laughs> what would I ever do without one of these? Okay, what the fuck am I supposed to do? What about this? Ah, it's this. My bad. Oh. Buddy, have a good day. Take a firecracker. Yeah, fight the firecracker. For all of it's done to you. Ow! Jesus Christ! Here, have another firecracker. Yeah, fight the firecracker. You're almost dead, aren't ya? <laughs> Jesus Christ, die! Fuck off, cunt. Jesus Christ. Give me this. Fuck off. Oops, sorry. My bad. I didn't see you there. 
<laughs> Sorry, I thought you could be a zombie. Oh my god, thank god. No, no! They're coming for you, Crane! They're, why don't you get up there, Crane? Thank you, Crane. Good job. Phew! Oh shit! That bastard scared the shit out of me. What the fuck is that? Hey, Doc. This is Kyle Crane. Chris! What can I do for you? I just saw this freaking weird zombie. He's covered in big green blisters. It, it hauled ass as soon as it spotted me. You know anything about it? <laughs> Not enough information, I'm afraid. But if you see another one, do let me know, will you? Okay, we got a lot of these. Frying pan's the only one that matters at the moment. Sleep until morning. Oh, I just slammed my head against the wall. Give me up here. Give me up here. Get me up here. Get me up here. I will fucking get up here. This is. Ugh. Ah oh, yeah, screw you. We definitely would have taken less time to just go around, but you know. Oh, oh, you know. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I can't get me. Fuck you. Yeah, give me your cigarettes. I'm gonna need them after this encounter. Fucking hell. Jesus Christmas. Another shop, very nice. Hey, what are you selling? I'll take that. I need rank five. Ah, uh, kind. It's all your fault. In the end. Crane. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. He lost the rest of his team to biters, and then Rise's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp, and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him, and you've got to back me up, okay? For God's Kay. sake! You can't even walk straight! We need you alive, you idiot! Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Yeah, sure, I can act. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him! Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right. Yes. Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Water. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right, you need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah, okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. Jade, a moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron, I'll be in touch shortly. Never, never, never knew why I was called the cauldron. Doc, there's something else we need to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He took a blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Laura tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Anti-seizure drugs were being passed out like candy when the infection first started. And the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Ghazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. His mother had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died two years ago. But Ghazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Ghazi can be very... insistent. So, they kept giving it to him. Think he's been stockpiling it all this time? 
If he hasn't, I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Ghazi lives under the overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Lord, Lord, what a hell of a way to die. There's his house right there. Hello. I know this is his house. Gazi, is anybody in here? <laughs> oh, this is his house. My bad. Mama ain't happy. Nobody happy. So you better make Mama happy. Gazi. Me too. We have the same name. Are you from the video store? No, my name's Crane. Crane? Crane rhymes with train and brain and sane and grain and rain and plane and the other kind of plane and and. But can I come in? No, no. It's impossible. Impossible. This is my special day with mom. It's Mother's Day, and it's the most important day of the whole world. Are you from the video store? Why do you keep asking me that? Uh, because you're supposed to bring my movie about me. It's called Charlie, and it's all about me, and how smart I am. Look, Gazi, if I bring you your movie, will you let me come in? Sure. Then you could watch with us. It is Mother's Day, and if Mama ain't happy, Nobody happy. Oh, and, and she also wants chocolate. Mama wants chocolate. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Break my legs. It's always good for the soul. Oh, right here. Chocolate, coffee, chocolate. Ooh, lots of coffee. There we go, special box of chocolates. Okay. Let's just see if we can figure this out. Oh, the door. See, I'm colorblind, guys. I'm stupid. Okay, leave me alone. Son of a bitch, not nope. now. Mm. Gotcha. Yes? Here's your movie and your chocolates. Wait till mom see this. Oh, Gazi wins again. Hooray for Gazi! Right. Yeah, then I'll just let myself in through the roof. Come on. You're not that dumb. Okay, maybe you are. Yes, there we go. <laughs> nope, that was never gonna happen. I don't even know why I tried that. I'm sorry, guys. You had to see that. Actually, maybe you don't. Just getting some bullshit. I have to go through this many fucking steps to get up to a one. Ah, oh, there we go. Fuck off. I'm not climbing nowhere. Yeah, sorry, Gazi. I, I know you don't really, really know what I'm doing, but I kind of feel like a dick nonetheless. Just taking your shit. Nice shoes, though. Hello, Gazi. Shh. The movie is on. Mama's watching. Is Mama happy? Yeah. 
Mama's real happy. Guzzy got her chocolates and a movie. Well, then I'm gonna take some medicine to help my friend. Well, okay. Oh, Mama stopped getting seizures when her head turned into a pumpkin. They're on the table. Yeah, thanks, Gazi. Gazi make everybody happy. Is the ring gonna come out of here? Ah, tranquilizers. Okay, goodbye, Gazi. Lena. I got you a present, Lena. Where are you, Lena? I've got your anti seizure yeah. medicine. Thanks. Oh, how things go with Gazi? Well, he may be challenged, but he's very good at getting what he wants. Did you meet his mom? Yeah, she seemed happy. If mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. Speaking of which, Brecken asked me to pass this on to you. With his thanks. Okay, we have another survivor point. And we're definitely going to be putting this shit into barter. Just because nightmare mode, I don't want. I don't know what the fuck's gonna be happening. Just die! I don't know why you would keep them alive. Honestly, if someone's fucking sick and on the verge of killing themselves, I would have fucking done it myself. Don't do that. Again. I'll do whatever I want. See? Look at me. What are you gonna do? Slow down. Alright guys, I think that is all the time I have for this episode. If you did like it, please do give this video a thumbs up. And as always, subscribe for more of my content. And I will see you guys in the near future.